attention now to uh, stories developing here in India, where the Delhi police, and we are turning now to the investigations into the murder of Shraddha Walkar, the Delhi police team has managed to reach Aftab's residence once again. That's exactly where he was apprehended from a few days ago, and that's where the fridge of horrors, the refrigerator where he preserved the body parts of Shraddha, were also recovered, and the Delhi police team can now, in fact, be seen uh, reaching Aftab's residence once again, presumably to conduct another recce of the place and see what kind of evidence can still manage to be unearthed from Aftab's residence. Certain blood samples have also been collected from some of the areas in the kitchen uh, as well, and those have now been sent to the uh, FSL lab for further investigation. But the Delhi police team has once again reached the residence of Aftab Punawala in order to uh, once again uh, look at some of the evidence that they can possibly recover. Savisachi uh, has been reporting on this since the day this happened. Uh, Savisachi, what can you tell us now about the Delhi police's presence at Aftab? What specifically could they be looking for once again? Well, absolutely, Siddharth, uh, the Delhi police team is at Aftab's uh, residence and uh, uh, they have uh, gone to Aftab's residence yesterday as well where they carried out uh, a demi uh, 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 drill at, at, at the crime scene. So clearly it could be very crucial from the Delhi police uh, point of view as well because a lot of evidences are there yet to be collected and that is the reason why Delhi police is present on ground will uh, definitely go again through all the minute details. As we know that the FSL team which had uh, been searching Aftab's uh, residence had successfully collected the blood samples from the untouched area of the uh, uh, kitchen and uh, clearly at right now Delhi police team is there at the spot. Uh, uh, there are along uh, four to five uh, police personnel who are present out there. So clearly this could be very important from the investigating point of view. Once again they would be searching uh, the entire house looking for minute details details and minute evidences that uh, might have, uh, might be uh, uh, of very importance. And uh, uh, Savya Sachi, if you could just give us an insight on what all has already been recovered from the residence of Aftab, because the last time Akanksha Kajuria was reporting from outside the residence, there were still some clothes that had been left to dry in one of the rooms uh, in the residence of Aftab. Has everything now been taken out? Has the residence, so to speak, completely been cleansed of all its contents? Well, absolutely. See, as of now, what they have collected is the electronic gadgets uh, from Aftab's uh, residence. And also they have the FSL team which were at the spot from day one. Uh, they have collected the blood samples from the untouched area in the kitchen. Uh, they have also collected uh, the uh, crime novels that he used to uh, read. So these are the evidences that they have collected. And also most important is the refrigerator which Aftab had bought by using Shraddha's money. That particular refrigerator has also been taken by the forensic department to check whether there is any uh, 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 blood samples left or not. So right now this would be a final check by the Delhi police to make sure that they have not left any sort of uh, evidence over there because earlier as we know that Aftab had used acid to clean the entire area. The Delhi police initially was facing a lot of problems to find out the blood samples because it has been six months since the incident took place and a lot of the evidence had been removed. So at this particular point, it was very important from uh, the Delhi police point of view to find some sort of evidence which could sh uh, prove that Shraddha was there at that particular night and she was murdered in that particular residence. Uh, so the Delhi police has successfully collected uh, the blood samples which would be a major uh, boost for the Delhi police because they were looking for some strong evidences in this case since the uh, uh, since the weapon that he used to chop the bodies of uh, Shraddha has not been recovered, since the skull and the torso area has not been recovered. So Delhi police wanted to gather some strong evidence before uh, 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 presenting him in front of the court tomorrow. But Delhi police have successfully uh, done so that they have got the blood samples. But the DNA test would also be very important because the DNA test will reveal that whether the blood samples 
match with the uh, blood of uh, Shraddha's father and also whether the remaining body parts which has been recovered from the Meroli Ridge also matches uh, with uh, Shraddha's father DNA. So it will be very crucial from Delhi's point of view that the DNA uh, result is there uh, in, in, in their favor. Favor. But yesterday the Delhi police had uh, gone along with the FSL team at the spot where they had taken a dummy as well to recreate the crime scene. Today again, Delhi police team has once again gone there uh, to search the entire house once again uh, to gather if uh, they have missed out on any evidence. Right. Uh, many thanks for that, Savya Sachi. Of course, uh, do stay with us because uh, we'll, of course, await more inputs of uh, what the Delhi police is actually on the lookout for now that it's managed to reach Aftab's residence once again, presumably trying to unearth more evidence now that has not been recovered so far. We have some more breaking news uh, coming in with respect to the developments surrounding the investigation so far in the Aftab case. And uh, we'll just come to that in just a short while. Those are still the visuals that we see of the Delhi police approaching the residence of Aftab for, four, uh, for, more, uh, for more evidence to be unearthed from the location. Savya Sachi, coming back to you now once again, this is all happening in the backdrop uh, of the Delhi police already having filed an application before the court uh, to seek a narco analysis of Aftab. It all, of course, hinges on whether or not he decides to consent and give his consent for that analysis to go ahead. Savya Sachi, coming back to you once again, uh, as we of course discuss uh, the kind of evidences that the Delhi police might be looking for from Aftab's residence. Uh, this is all of course happening at a time when Aftab's consent for the narco analysis that has been now requisitioned uh, still needs to be given before that test can actually be conducted so that the investigation can acquire a certain sense of direction. Well, absolutely. Uh, uh, see, the Delhi police is yet to uh, uh, receive the consent from AFTA for the narco test. Uh, but what makes the narco test very uh, important is that uh, till now the Delhi police have not recovered uh, the uh, uh, the uh, knife which AFTA has used to cut uh, the uh, body parts of Shraddha as well as the skull and torso area. So in this case and also the mobile phone. So in this case the narco test becomes very important because through this test uh, uh, Delhi police can get these details. We have also told our viewers that the Delhi police will also be performing a psychoanalysis on Aftab. This particular analysis will be done to understand the mindset as well as uh, the way he has killed, uh, he has brutally killed Shraddha and to understand the kind of relationship both uh, uh, Shraddha and Aftab had. So this particular test will also be very crucial. Now, Delhi police uh, would be uh, going to court to seek further custody of Aftab, uh, which we have told our viewers that the Delhi police wants more time to gather the evidence. Till now, the search uh, is still going on at the Mahiroli uh, Ridge area, where the, along with sniffer dogs, they are trying to find out the other uh, remains of Shraddha's body. And on the other hand, they have the Delhi police team have now reached Aftab's residence to again check if any sort of uh, 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 evidence is left behind because each and evidence in this particular case is very important because as of now the major breakthrough that the Delhi uh, police have got till of now is to collect the blood samples from uh, the kitchen area which can prove to be a breakthrough point and also at, at this particular point the Delhi police would be extending the, uh, the custody because they have said that Aftab is not cooperating properly he is not telling the entire truth